What's good guys, it's JB, and today I'll be teaching you a bunch of hiding spots in the blue house map. This is easily one of my favorite maps to play Yeeps in, so I thought I'd share my OP hiding spots. And trust me, if you watch the end of this video, you will win all of your games. Before we get into the video, can you like? It helps out a ton. I'm going to the toilet. Skibbity toilet, right? And join the Discord if you want to talk to me and other VR enthusiasts. And without further ado, let's actually get into the video now. We are not saving the best for last. I'm just going to walk up here and you tell me if you see the hiding spot. You see it? Let's well, come over here and look up at this roof. It's actually not a real roof. I built it and no one will ever find me. But straight up, who knows that there's an extra space here. But anyway, this hiding spot is made out of these bricks and this blue, dark blue paint. I'm gonna destroy it! Like, be for real, when's the last time you looked up there? Our next spot is also on this floor, and it uses the same technique. It's a lot of setup, just like the last one, but we're gonna want to fill this entire thing in with, like, these two squared blocks. Then we're gonna paint them all dark blue. Then we're gonna grab onto this one, or, I mean, really anyone. I'm just gonna go for this one for the sake of the video. And then we're just gonna hide here. Extra points if you put some decoys over here, and, like, a voice decoy inside here. Like, that would go crazy. This one's really OP, too. Yesterday I was doing a 1v1 with my friends and this third hiding spot almost made them win. So if you can't see, we're on the side of the house, like the, the side that's not filled with stuff. And then we're gonna place a block right there. Then we're gonna paint it dark blue. And then you're gonna do the same to the other side and paint it dark blue. No one is gonna know you're here as long as you're not like, ooh. For this next hiding spot, you do not need any items and it's actually really good. So we're gonna come on top of this bunk bed. And we're literally just gonna pick this up and put it down like this. For some reason, people just walk down here expecting there to be something and then don't check this block. Like, be honest, can you see me? I lied, I wasn't in that block, I was outside the frame. Obviously, if someone's just going on a rampage and throwing stuff and getting rid of it, this hiding spot is not gonna work. Here's another easy one to set up, but I warn you, you probably get found. You're just gonna go right here, you're gonna take this block, and you're gonna put it right back where you found it. I cannot do that for some reason. This next one is super OP, but it's hidden in plain sight right in this campfire. So we all know we can go inside of this campfire and show up and hide in the oven. But be honest, can you see me? I put an extra block there. Literally when you walk in like this, this just feels so natural even though there's nothing there. Bonus points if you put a body decoy here because then they're gonna think that you tricked them and they're gonna run out. Now this next spot is absolutely dirty because a lot of people forget about it. All right, try to find it. Do you see, it's right there. I put a pillow and colored it the same color right there. And then I went up here, I can put this here and just sit up here in this one by one space. But anyway, now you should be a blue house god. If this video helped you, make sure to like the video. Make sure to join the Discord too, it's really cool. And without further ado, I'll see you later. Was that a, was that a cool thing I did? I hope it was.